Hey guys, so I talked about the unboxing of my Nucleus M in the last video and just really fast I want to talk about a really cool piece of functionality that I found on this that I actually didn't know about before and I'm kind of really excited about it so this will be really fast but I just want to talk about it and sorry if this little screen is flickering it kind of looks like it is the frequency might not quite work out with my camera but what can you do? Um, so on the side you've got these four buttons and these ones here, one says mark and one says delete. And they're really cool because say you have a lot of movement in your scene, you can go to your first position, double click on mark, and it'll give you a little thing that says A, right? And you go to your second position, double click mark again, and then you've got your B. So you've got a third position, C, and so on. And what's really cool about this is that as I'm twisting and hitting these marks, it slightly vibrates. And I think that's really cool because it's a really good just, oh, stop focusing, you're there moment. But it might not be the most useful thing on set because I don't know if it's going to be loud enough for sound pickup. But regardless, the fact that you can set these little marks on the display is just really, really cool and super useful as a first assistant camera. Thanks for watching this little piece of information about the Tilta Nucleus M wireless follow focus. If you learned something, be sure to like this video and or subscribe to my channel.